It's standard practice to talk about what a rifle has, not what it lacks. But Kimber's mountain ascent is conspicuous not for what it includes, but what it leaves out, namely weight. Can you imagine a 306 bolt action rifle weighing less than six pounds? This unit does. In fact, it weighs five pounds, two ounces without a scope, mounts, and ammo on board. Short action chamberings weigh even less, a mere four pounds, 13 ounces. In case anyone missed the significance of that, let me say the Mountain Ascent is the lightest production big game rifle in the world. But a reduction in weight does not mean the rifle is incapable of superior performance. This is the same rifle I carried in Namibia several years ago, where I took several Plains game species, including Blue Wildebeest and Red Hartebeest. That's right, with a mountain rifle suited to high country pursuits like sheep and elk, I walked mostly level ground on the plains of Africa. Normally, a light rifle doesn't necessarily settle in the shooting stick. It tends to be whippy, and keeping it steady while you control your breathing and line up a shot sometimes seems impossible. But the mountain ascent is loaded with custom-like features to deliver Kimber's sub-MOA standard of accuracy. It's a controlled round feed, bolt action, front locking, center fire repeater with an overall length of about 41 to no more than 44 inches. It's machined from round stainless steel bar stock. Hallmarks include a claw extractor, dual opposed locking lugs, and a three position safety. Everything needed to chamber and fire around shortly, then extract and eject the case smartly. In this case though, everything on or around the action is whittled to accommodate cartridges with the common bolt face included in the 3006, 308 family of cartridges. Spiral fluting covers the bolt body. The bolt handle is hollow and fluted. Even the claw extractor took a shave. It's lightened with three cuts along its length. The internal box magazine is blind. There is no drop floor plate to aid unloading and increase weight. It holds four rounds. One look at the wide trigger guard proves it's lightweight aluminum. Its finish stands slightly in contrast to the finish of the stainless steel metalwork elsewhere. All metalwork is coated with Kempro 2 weatherproofing. The stainless steel barrel is slender, includes a match grade chamber, and measures 24 inches long on standard cartridges, 22 inches on short actions. It's fluted and threaded, and is fitted with a muzzle brake to reduce recoil. A thread protector and a tool to install it is included with each rifle to use when a brake is not desired. The trigger is single stage and match grade. It's adjustable, but there is no need to bother when it's factory set at 3.5 to 4 pounds pull weight. The chamber is match grade too, and the action is pillar and glass bedded to enhance accuracy. The stock is straight up American style and made of Kevlar reinforced carbon fiber like the stock on Kimber's Montana and Talkeetna rifles. It's covered in soft touch gore optifade digital camo in an exclusive open country pattern. The straight comb, evidenced by a shallow drop at heel and comb, tames recoil remarkably well. But recoil is further mitigated thanks to a one inch Pacmar decelerator recoil pad. Length of pull is comfortable, 13.75 inches on standard lathe chamberings and just a bit shorter on smaller calibers at 13.63 inches. I love light rifles. I think there's something special about removing every bit of material possible while still maintaining performance. The one thing I don't like about the equation, they're whippy, as I said. They're so light, they can make it difficult to maintain proper sight picture. There is just so little weight present. Compound that with huffing and puffing due to buck fever and altitude, good luck, right? But to say the mountain ascent is not the ticket for Africa is an understatement. It had looked good and performed better laid across a pack in Alaska, taking aim at a distant sheep. But in Africa, I and my hunting partner who shared the gun took more than a dozen Plains Gain species. The rifle carried, shouldered, and fired time and again, accurately and without fail. Natural point of aim, cheek weld, eye relief, proper sight picture, all were there whenever we needed them. The Mountain Ascent is a fine addition to the Kimber Mountain Rifle family, which includes the Montana and the Adirondack. It is all the rifle anyone could ever want to hunt the world. Its suggested list price is $2,040. Check it out in calibers from 7mm 08 Remington to 300 Win Mag at KimberAmerica.com. And for more Sunday Gun Day, any day of the week, visit AmericanHunter.org.